So it was thought, it was said, it was in the memory, it was in the brain, it was in the mindset of the WWE, the creative team, that, well, Roman Reigns would be in the main event of WrestleMania. Roman Reigns wanted the headline. Roman Reigns wanting to close the show. Much like Roman Reigns has closed the show multiple times, win, lose, or draw, Roman Reigns has been a part of history at WrestleMania in his very young, successful, youthful career. But now Roman Reigns says he don't give a damn about the WrestleMania main event. He just is a part of it. He just likes the fact that he's alive and he can breathe air and he's going to be right there. And that's fear. But you see, here's the thing. You see, Roman Reigns, and I, I'm a big Roman Reigns fan, and I'm glad he beat cancer. My mom and dad went through cancer. But if your main objective is to be a WWE superstar, no matter if you've main evented WrestleMania once or ten times, you would think that if you want to be at a pivotal, a pivotal moment in your career, and I know there would have been a lot of hate by a lot of WWE detractors and a lot of um, AEW um, enthusiasts and a lot of um, other indie wrestlers or marks, marks, whatever you want to call them. The thing about it is, and again, I'm, I'm a guy that's a Stone Cold fan, a Brock Lesnar fan, a Randy Orton fan, a John Cena fan, a Triple H fan. I'm a fan of a lot of wrestlers. I grew up watching Razor Ramon, my first favorite wrestler of all time, Scott Hall, Razor Ramon. Hey, yo. Bro, shout out to Vince Russo. But um, Roman Reigns says he doesn't care what position or what spot he is in at WrestleMania. Now, that's easy to say when you're going to be in, the, in, in, front, in front of zero fans at the arena. Now, I know they're going to be taping WrestleMania from very different locations, various locations, different destinations. And I get that and I understand that. But for Roman Reigns to say that he doesn't care about his spot on the card, he's just proud to be there. I don't know. I mean, Stone Cold, imagine him coming back and saying, oh, well, I, I just want to be the curtain jerker or I just want to be in the, in the middle of the card. If you're going to be at WrestleMania, if you're going to perform at WrestleMania, don't you want to be the main event? Now, listen, in my, in my heart of hearts, I do believe that the best built-up storyline and angle and furiousness and, um, you know, the ability and the agility and the um, mannerisms, the promos, uh, the insanity, um, the velocity would be, you know, in my opinion, yes, Edge, Randy Orton, the main event at WrestleMania. I believe that should be the main event, even though it's not a world title match. But we have seen in the past where world title matches doesn't necessarily mean you're going to main event at WrestleMania. A pay-per-view, a Raw, or a SmackDown. Sometimes a match is bigger than a title. And this is sometimes where, you know, the titles get devalued and they're not looked at as in the way they should be. But Roman Reigns coming on, again, I like Roman Reigns. I'm a Roman Reigns fan, and I'm going to catch a lot of hate at detractors. I might be down to zero subscribers because I say this. And I'm not just saying this because I'm on the Roman Reigns bandwagon. Again, I'm a fan of Austin, The Rock, DX. Hell, I'm even a, Michael, I'm even a fan of some of Michael Cole's commentary. But I'm a big JR fan. I think JR would bring a hell of a lot more passion to the announcer's table. I think I would bring a hell of a lot more passion to the announcer's table. But what I'm seeing is I'm very shocked. I'm very surprised that Roman Reigns would go on record saying that he don't care what the WrestleMania main event is. He don't care if he's in the main event. He don't care where he is at WrestleMania as long as he, as long as he is there. And you know what? I can appreciate Roman Reigns saying something like that. But Roman Reigns, and this is what surprises me, he says he doesn't care if his match headlines in main events WrestleMania. Roman Reigns says he doesn't care if his match is the closing act at WrestleMania. You want to know why that is? It's because maybe Roman Reigns has got a little bit too wide for his britches because Roman Reigns has already been there and he has already done that. But if you're not in there to be the main event, if you're not in there to steal the show, if you're not in there to show what you're all about, if you don't want to be the main event at WrestleMania, well, then you ain't got no reason to be here. Because if you look at the Rocks, the Austins, the Hogans, the Bruno, Cier Bruno Ciarmitinos, the you know you, you look at the times of times and times and times of wrestlers and superstars and athletes who have main event at a headline WrestleMania. Your main goal is to either main event WrestleMania over and over as many times as you can because you have a very limited space or you want to become the WWE champion. Now, I just felt that Roman Reigns saying that, and here's the thing that bothers me. Roman Reigns, and thank God, thank God, cross my fingers. If I cross my fingers, Roman Reigns has fought and he has battled and he has won the, the fight, the war with cancer. 
Much like we're fighting a war with Corona right now, which is ridiculous and repulsive and sick and sinister. Roman Reigns overcomes cancer. He's out of the world title scene for the last year and a half, two years. He comes back. He's in a big time match. He's in a big time match at Goldberg. Goes on the record and says, I'm just happy to be here. And I'm happy to be a part of WrestleMania. And that's fine. I respect that. There's great gratitude and respect there. But Roman, you overcame cancer. Wouldn't you want to have this come full circle? Wouldn't you want this to come full circle and say, you know what? I beat cancer. I overcame injuries. I overcame insurmountable odds. I overcame the detours. I overcame the backlash. I overcame the animosity. I overcame the booze. Because you got to understand where I'm coming from. Again, you don't have to agree with me. Listen, I love the fact that Roman Reigns is alive. I love the fact that Roman Reigns is thriving. But Roman Reigns coming on here saying, oh, well, you know, WrestleMania, it's 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 like, it's, it, this is WrestleMania. But, albeit, this is a very different and peculiar WrestleMania. This is a very odd WrestleMania. This is a WrestleMania unlike anything else. Now, if there were fans in attendance and if there were fans there, I can guarantee you, un, under the circumstances that we're under, again, I'm all things considered, again, I'm a Roman Reigns fan. I'm not a bandwagoner, but I've been a Roman Reigns fan ever since he was a singles wrestler back before he entered the WWE. I've been following Roman Reigns' career ever since. And again, you don't have to be a Roman Reigns liker. You can be a disliker. You can be a hater. You can be a naysayer, whatever you want. But I guarantee him to you right now that Roman Reigns would be fighting for that WrestleMania spot, the main event. Because what do you want as the closing? What? How do you want WrestleMania to end? Do you want it to end as a curtain jerker or in the mid card or in the side card or in the pre-show? Or do you want to end it with the main event with the glitz, the glam, and the fireworks? The problem is, is there ain't going to be no fireworks and glitz and glamour. There ain't going to be no pageantry. There ain't going to be no granddaddy of them all because there ain't going to be no fans. So, I can, I, again, I like to analyze things from all sides. Remember, this is the brash and the brazen. The most important things you can do is share, subscribe, and remember to share my videos all over Facebook and Twitter and tell all your friends, all your boyfriends, and all your girlfriends. That's the most important thing you can do to light Sean's view on fire. But I'm just surprised. I'm a little bit taken aback. That for the first ever WrestleMania where there'll be no fans, there's still history being made. Why wouldn't want? Why wouldn't Roman Reigns want to main event this WrestleMania and close out WrestleMania as the WWE Universal Champion? I have a lot more questions. I have a lot more doubts than answers to this one, ladies and gentlemen. What do you feel about? Again, I don't. I'm not taking anything away from Roman Reigns, but after all the health, after all the well-being, after all the injuries, after the cancer, after everything Roman Reigns has been through, and again, this is going to be one of the most spectacular WrestleManias of all time, and the fact that it's going to be much different. It's going to be out of the box. It is going to be something we've never witnessed before. Why wouldn't Roman Reigns want to be the main event? Now, again, I do believe that Randy Orton and Edge should have the main event. They deserve the main event. They've earned the main event. They've earned that recognition. But why wouldn't Roman Reigns want to fight for that? Why wouldn't Roman Reigns want to go for that? I mean, Roman Reigns and Goldberg is a match of matches, ladies and gentlemen. It is a match that writes itself. You don't need a hell of a lot of shock and storyline and aura behind it. Roman Reigns and Goldberg should be the main event of WrestleMania to many people. But if I were Roman Reigns and I overcame cancer and injuries and hospitalizations and I overcame suspensions and all that, I don't know why Roman Reigns wouldn't want to main event WrestleMania. Yeah, there may not be you no know, fans in the attendance, but there are going to be a lot of fans watching at home. And you know what? Honestly, and I might be dumb or stupid for this, I think just because of the factor that this is going to be the most original WrestleMania, the most creative WrestleMania of all time, that should give Roman Reigns every single way, every single factor to want to headline the main event WrestleMania. But that's just me. I could be wrong. And again, this is coming from a Roman Reigns fan. I could be wrong. I might be indifferent. I might be in between. I might be in the box. I might be out of the box. But the fact that Roman Reigns says I'm just privileged to be a part of WrestleMania, I can respect that and I get that. Because not many superstars get a part or a shot at WrestleMania. But you would think someone with the drive, the motivation, and overcoming all the odds that Roman Reigns would want to be in the main event of WrestleMania. What I would do if I'm in a creative standpoint on the next Monday Night Raw, which I know has already been taped, but if I were on the creative team, what I would have done is this. It would have been Roman Reigns and Goldberg. In a two-on-two -two match, Roman Reigns and Goldberg versus Edge and Randy Orton with the winning team being the main event of WrestleMania. That's how I would have booked this. But again, everyone says I'm stupid and I don't know what I'm talking about. Everyone says I shouldn't be on the creative team, but I think I would give a lot of steam. I think I would give a lot of momentum. I think I would put a lot of ideas in people's heads. I think I would be creative. 
I would put Goldberg and Roman Reigns as one tag team and a, and a dream team against rated RKO. The winning team main events and headlines WrestleMania. That's what I would have done. That's how I would have booked things. But again, everyone says, I don't know what I'm talking about. Do you agree or disagree? Your comments, your opinions, more to come from the brash and the brazen. I work around the clock. I am prolific, consistent, and dedicated. And I will say that to I'm blue in the face because that's what I'm about. That's what I believe in. That's the heart, the passion, and the gratitude that I have. Refresh my channel multiple times a day. Tell your friends, your boyfriends, your girlfriends, whether you're on break, in the bathroom, in the shower, at work, at school, wherever you are. Watch Sean's Unitainment multiple times a day. And don't go away because there's a lot more where this came from. What should be the main event of WrestleMania? Roman Reigns versus Goldberg or Randy Orton versus Edge? Your thoughts, your comments, and remember to go with like my official Facebook fan page, Sean's Viewing on YouTube over on Facebook. Yes, you heard right. Sean's Viewing on YouTube. Type that in the title on YouTube. Type that on YouTube and then go on Facebook and type in the same thing, Sean's View Ent over on Facebook and like my official Facebook fan page right now. More to come. Subscribe and thrive. Good luck.